Hello, what's up, everyone? Welcome back to episode 19 of Stargate Invasion: Agents vs. Rafe. It's been going well. We are finally beginning to we we're winning the war. We're winning the enemy, and we have our capital ship up and running. She is a powerful vessel with lots of advantages against the enemy. Also, going on at the, the home world is three new capital ships have just been built, three Antis classes, and are being dispatched on right now. Plus, ten Azuran Atropos classes has just been well, two, one more is being built, and then ten Atropos classes will then have been built. And two of the capitals will be sent to the main fleet, plus the Atropos classes, and one capital ship will go and help the, the capital ship win the war down south, while we push ahead with the main fleet down a year. Pruna, Anubis, the world, Salinas, Manar, Sahal, and Heliopus. So, let's get going. Let's get these guys on the way. Let's get on with it. How long will this one take? No. Nope. Almost thought the cat was going to sit on my mouse again, but luckily she didn't. She can be very spiteful sometimes. If any of you guys have a cat out there, you would know. They are really, really hungry for attention sometimes. So how goes our capital ship? The reason she is doing so well is our shield mitigation is at 95%. And she, her shields, that's why our shields are holding so strongly. It's because the sh those shields can't be penetrated. They're, they're like, nah, maybe later. What? Laser turret? Awesome! Enhanced ZPMs? Oh. You can power for the movement in the defense. That's cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Um, I'm just going to not put on the push. The escape button. That's the one. Let's just get this. I don't know why the effect volume is so loud, anyways. That's good. Sorry about that, guys. I was playing some Star Trek on Mod 3. Wink, wink, nut, nudge. So that might be why. So if you guys have seen my new Oh there's my laser turret, that's that actually fine. But anyways, if you guys have seen my new trailer for my upcoming on campaign with the Klingons in Star Trek on Model 3, then you um, know that I'm really excited and pumped to finally get that on the way. And if you haven't seen it yet, go and check it out, it's really nice. Um, if you're wondering, uh, it is in the description, it's from the movie, short film, a Prelude to Exanar, which is basically just a, a short film of why the Klingons and the humans have bad blood between them. It's actually quite an interesting film, so definitely go and check that out. But yeah, that... That exactly sums up why the Klingons, why the Klingons, I chose them as, as a race to play as. Firstly, I haven't played them in Star Trek or Modern Free. I've played the Borg and the Federation and that's it. I haven't played the Klingons or the Romulans. So I think the Klingons will be an interesting faction to play as. And also, I like a, a warrior race. And they remind me kind of like the samurai and of the Japanese, all Japanese, so they really are a lot, remind me a lot of that, so, and I'm a big fan of Samurais and guys like that, so, yeah, it's like a fitting on a glove, it just works well, so I'm definitely going to be putting that up, hopefully I'll be able to finish this season this week, I'm really going to be pushing that, I'll be uploading two videos today so definitely go check that out so our fleets are moving out Kapla. sorry wrong series i'm now in the spirit of this the star trek i i've been watching literally everything i can about star trek um i've watched next generation and um 
Voyager. I've watched those, but I haven't watched uh, DS9. Whoa, where am I? Oh, and I've also watched the Enterprise one with uh, Captain Archer. But I haven't watched DS9. So I'm at season 5 at the moment with that. And I must say, Cisco, really cool guy. I like the Defiant. The Defiant is a kick ass ship. Small but deadly. I like that. That in the ship. That is really fun to me. But yeah, enough Star Trek. You will definitely be seeing more Star Trek. But for the moment, we are in Stargate. Uh, let's go to 8 times speed. There's nothing like. The, there's nothing the Wraith can do at this point to stop me. You don't have the power. You don't have the power. Whoa, or maybe they do. Oh, she's kaboom. Oh, no, they don't. Never mind. Sorry about that, guys. Some technical difficulties there, but we're back. So, let's get that fight up and running. And while that is happening, let's see where the rest of our fleet is. Alright, the main... The new fleet is over here. And where's our lone wolf? Hungry like a wolf. It's not here, then where is it? Okay, there's two over here. Two Antius classes over there. Now where's the third? Alright, that is kinda strange. There should be an Antius class around here somewhere. Titan over here. Oh, never mind. The Titan is taking care of things. The Titan. Titan oh. oink, oink. But um one thing I am quite excited about is the GTA 5 for PC coming out. And uh, I'm definitely I've already pre-ordered it and once it comes out somewhere in January, if I am correct, then I will definitely be getting my bad buddies. I uh, will definitely get some videos up running of that as well. Do some heists, rob some banks, and so forth. Let's see, where's all our anti clubs? We've got two over there. And. Right. I. No. There's a colony ship over there, then. Alright, wait, 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 there, it, there she is, alright, she's three jumps away. Alright, never mind guys, found it, found her, don't be alarmed, oh, goody, another colony ship. Another idiot that thinks he can touch me. Sad little idiots. How idiotic you must be. Your idiotici, idiocy, won't save you now. Unlocked interference. Yeah, let's get that. Why not? There's not much I can research anymore, actually. Should probably get some more civilian labs up and running. Crazy barrier. Max fleet supply increase. Yeah, let's get that. Why not? One ZP empowered sensors. Grants detection of any starship performing a hyperspace jump. Quite nice. Oh good. You have damaged 500 shields while I am defeating your entire <laughs> No match. And wait till my Antius class come here. Then you will whoop us. As will be Antius class, come to me. And I have to say, my resources are looking up. Also, my chair is fixed. I have a comfortable chair again. So, everything is coming up. 
Klingon series will be out soon. And Chair is back. Everything is coming up Skyquake's way. So, let's see. Our new fleet is in position. Now, let's send in the fleet. All ships, prepare for battle. <laughs> there we go. Move to this location. 79 fighter squadrons. That's a lot. You got it. Whoa, what's going on over here now? Just a lot of fighters, eh? Hey. Oh, so, sister. I don't wanna kiss her on the radio. These guys are really kicking. Getting their asses whooped, but they're still coming. Every single time they're coming. And this class is over here. Two more jumps. Well, one, yeah, two jumps. Alright, our fleet is at this co at these coordinates. What the frack is over here? Alright, I just found their entire fleet. Literally every single ship they own is here. Look at all these ships. What the fudge? That's a lot of ships. No wonder the game is lagging. All the ships are here. All those fighters have just taken out one of my uh, cruisers. That's how many fighters they have. The beam weapon is already taken. This assault type has shields. No, they're not shields. The shields mitigation is 4%, but still strong enough. Those beams are, lit uh, are luckily cutting their enemy to shreds. Their super hive is destroyed, and now send in the rest of the ships. Effect has been acquired. Good, 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 good. Effect has been acquired. We like to hear such news. Such is great news for the Empire. The Empire wishes only such news to happen. Come on. Ask your Luckily, uh, the Star Trek Armada can freaking build these structures. They don't have this kind of problem. No, not what I wanted. Freaking animals. Can I build turrets? No, I can't. Goody, 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 goody. Uh, let's build 35 of them. 35 should be enough. I guess. So how fair is our city over here? Shields are still holding quite nicely. But it hasn't upgraded yet. Oh, almost there. So how goes... Alright, whoa. Wait, hold on. There we go. Give her jumpers. I said jumpers. Yeah, the lag is quite extensive now. Let's give her that and another one of those. Another ship has just been upgraded. Oh, it's the same ship, it's just saying it's level 3 now. Alright, well, our fleet is being decimated right now. Alright, I'm just going to tell my fleet to um, run away and hide for the rest of their life. I think I just lost my hide ship as well. I can't see in all the I'm just losing ships now, left and right. All those fighters are just killing ships. I'm definitely going to need to get fighter killers as soon as possible. Jump guys, jump, 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 go. Alright, so, recap. Did not expect that in the least. Oh well, I'll replace them. No problems. Uh, Nakoda. Nakoda, Nakoda, Nakoda. Thou is a heartless bitch. I just lost a major part of my fleet. I was like, nothing can stop me except their overwhelming numbers of fighters. Yeah, they can stop you quite easily, I had to say. Yeah. Um, yeah, these Jinsuru Sentinels, build all of them. All of them. Build all the things. 
Oh, this is a laser turret. Where is my other capital? There she is. The fleet. The mine. The mine fleet is here. Let's see what's going on here. Firing drones. Yoink. Destroy. I watch over the fleet. Well, I guess twelve of these guys should be enough to, to handle any of the enemies. Hopefully. Now well, let's build one of these guys. Just to be on the safe side of life. And get more Nakoda immediately. And yeah, just get more Nakoda. Let's buy all the things. There we go. Get me my anti glasses. Get anything else, get me my antiases. Show you a target? Um, right over there is their entire effing fleet of fighters. The ships I can handle, the ships are nothing, they're puny in comparison. It's their fighters that I'm concerned with. Those fighters are massive. I, I, they probably have 200 fighter squadrons. That is my problem. I can't handle that kind of firepower. Strangely enough, eh? can handle the entire ships, but I can't handle 200 fighter squadrons. That's why I lost the war. Because I couldn't handle the fighters. Now these, that's what these guys are for. They're... Just... Oh, okay. These drones are just for uh, anti-fighters. It's anti-fighters. Instead of firing at ships, they fire at anti-fighters. That is going to be much effective. Much more effective. How is our ships going? Oh, we're still building. Well, there goes all our economy that I was building up. But luckily I had it in the first place. And I was like, 79 fighters, that's more than enough. Man, they were like... <laughs> What, what kind of fighter squadron is that? A small one, they said. A small one. Okay, well, my timer just went off, so thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can start stay in touch with all my Stargate Invasion episodes and all my other series as well. Please guys, it helps out a lot, so please take a second or two to hit the thumbs up and subscribe, it really means a lot. Thank you guys also so much for supporting the series, and uh, get me, getting me on the right foot, it really means a lot. So, thank you guys so much for watching, take care, and 